Now he gets the Liliana ult us, because we just haven't drawn any cards to do anything. I just want to see how he's going to separate the piles. He's also down on clock here, so... And how does this card read? We select that permanent. Sacrifices all permanent piles of truth. So whichever pile we choose is the pile we lose. So we're 25 cards into the deck without a Restoration Angel. I guess we drew two cards this game, so can't be too unhappy about it. He should just put creatures versus lands. You're not wrong. Spells anyway. Beloth, Dismember's fine. A couple of Helix are fine. Scavenging is just fine. Missionary's not great. Pontiff's not great. Pride Mage isn't great. Uh, Mere Superior's probably fine. I actually like cutting some mana, guys. I'm torn on whether or not, uh, we've never beaten the Eldrazi deck. It's great. I think... Hmm. One more cut. Maybe I just don't want all these helixes. You can see this being true. So we were in that game for a little bit. Uh, he also made quite a few mistakes, so... I think if our agenda opponent had been playing optimally, we would have been much further out of that game than we actually were. Are you awake and want to come out? The worships just aren't very good. All of the Eldrazi decks have ways to interact with them. They just weren't, weren't like, they're basically like being four mana discard a card. Yep, this hand is lands and spells, so we'll keep. I just don't like to mulligan against the decks that have a bunch of discard spells in it. So, like, this is an attrition matchup where every card counts. So, like, having the most possible cards to start with. Uh, we've got some, hands got some clunk in it, but. Yes. Some hands need to draw lands, some hands need to draw spells. I actually registered 60... The, when I top aided regionals, I played 63 cards. It actually just, like, for the most part, doesn't matter. Yeah, see? It doesn't matter. So, like, you mulligan a, a slower hand like this and do a faster hand, he's just going to thought seize you, and then your hand's worse than before. So, just keep anything. Act actual anything. If they thought sees Tarmogoyf Liliana that curve, you're just not going to win the game anyway, so. You happy boy? Hmm? Uh, my sideboard from regionals, the only interesting card in it was Dismember, and I've been playing those now, so. Hey, look, not a land. 
So I expect to just miss the third land drop here and then never cast the spell. Hey, look at that. Things are coming up Millhouse. We're going to fetch a stomping ground here. Corsair's rough if he has Liliana, but uh, I think we just need the best chance to hit our fourth land next turn. Yeah, and when I played 63, I just, like, wanted another toolbox card. I was, like, definitely getting Liliana here. Yep, Octopus. It's a tough play, because, like, I don't think Liliana is actually good against the court deck. Some people board it out, but the way our opponent played, I probably should have just assumed that he wasn't going to board out the Lilianas. That's why, when you try to play, when you try to play, stop throwing my phone on the ground, you little brat. When you try to, when you play magic, like leveling is often something that comes up, but you can only be one level above your opponent. If you're two levels above them, you're just leveling yourself. Yeah, they're doing that now. They're like doing like multiple GPs in the same weekend. Bolt for the bird. Of course, why not, man? Or I discard this quarter calling we can't cast. Uh, if we hit running lands here, we might be okay. Kitchen Vinks? Course of his own. Sweet. Alright. Yeah, sometimes you just don't get to play Magic. Well, that's the game. Oh, you know what? I'm going to change a diaper real quick. He just woke up. His diaper's kind of full. I'll be right back. I'm going to take a quick break. Thanks for hanging out. It'll be like two minutes.
one more time. I watched you play them all week. I'm ready to play. Yes, you are. Are you two playing nice? Are you hungry, Dickling? We can salvage the old 2 3 here. I, sadly, I am playing in Louisville on Saturday. If I did not need SCG points, I would be skipping the event. Playing Modern has not been enjoyable lately. In addition to, you know, all the other things where sometimes you just die, like there's just, you know, there's Eldrazi on top of it. Yen, super reasonable hand, got Inquisition on one. Drew, Drew Mare Superior on two, just like we drew it up. Perfect. Probably, I have access to an Eldrazi deck, and the the the, the way this has been going. Uh, this is, this is just like, we should probably, I should probably just be like finding the best Eldrazi deck to play. The problem with like, playing a metagamed anti-Eldrazi deck is that you'll show up and you'll play one of those decks and then you'll just play against the other half of the field or like in reality um Eldrazi is only going to be like mostly the top tables so like if you're uh, yeah, I'll shut myself. um if you're doing well you'll play against more Eldrazi but like it, realistically you might I might only play against Eldrazi like two maybe three times in the tournament so like you know, Mir Superion's been reasonable. He's been glued to our opening hands, which is awkward. All right, don't actually just like we're in we're in the we're in a moto league. Our opponent's inclusion thought seized into Shriek Mada, so just like actual no idea what's going on. Voice is probably an okay draw against an attrition deck. Hopefully, he's an attrition deck. So, like, the problem is, you know, there's going to be probably at least 600 people there, and not all those people, like, having, expecting 200 people to have found copies of the Eldrazi deck, I think is unrealistic. And if it gets up into 800 and 1,000 person count, like, have, expecting, you know, three and 400 people to have access.